European Union lawmakers have urged action ahead of Wednesday's vote on a plan to relocate 40,000 refugees across the bloc. The figure pales in comparison to Syria's neighboring countries. Almost 4 million have flooded into Lebanon, Jordan, and Turkey. As CCTV's Jack Barton reports, the European Parliament remains deeply divided on the issue with tempers flaring. Still leading the compassionate charge, Germany's leader now says her country could take half a million refugees a year. Taking a tougher stance, Denmark has placed ads in Lebanese newspapers detailing welfare cuts to refugees and tougher rules, essentially warning asylum seekers not to come. Those stark divisions were laid bare at the European Parliament on Tuesday, which debated an emergency plan to redistribute 40,000 refugees across the bloc. Potential terrorists, as we've already seen, can enter countries unhindered and unchecked and move around the continent, as will be the case with this mechanism. This is a short-term, knee-jerk response to solving a problem with a quick fix. I'm deeply ashamed that the British government is not willing to follow the German example. In fact, it seems to be aligning more with the Danish one in terms of benefits, as if somehow creating poverty and destitution amongst those who are pushed to come here is something to be proud of. The EU Commissioner for Migration told the Parliament the new measures would help frontline EU countries. The aim of this proposal is uh, twofold relieve the pressure from Italy and Greece and ensure a dignified treatment of the persons concerned. The European Commission President Jean-Claude Juncker will use his annual State of the Union address at the European Parliament on Wednesday to spell out the EU executive arm's new migration policy. That is expected to push many member states to accepting far more refugees than they have so far been willing to take. European officials say the Commission may also seek to make new rules mandatory if it can secure the backing of a strong majority of member states. A previous attempt to create mandatory quotas for refugee resettlement was rejected after requiring a unanimous vote. Some countries, including Poland and Hungary, have again promised to vote against new mandatory resettlement rules for refugees, seeking instead much tougher border controls. Jack Barton, CCTV, Brussels.